All right, in this video, I want to quickly go over how you can install Cocoa Pods on your Mac. Um, this comes in real handy if you're using certain libraries or um, tools with Xcode. Um, actually, I have a series coming up where I'm going to show you how to use SQL Lite with Xcode, and you need to have Cocoa Pods on uh, installed. Um, so anyway, to see if you have Cocoa Pods, you can uh, put in pod dash dash version, press enter, um, and you should um, get a return of uh, a version. Uh, this 1.12.1 is current as of uh, the posting of this video. Um, however, uh, in the making of this, I actually got an error, said it was not installed. I don't, I'm not sure what happened. I must have somehow uninstalled it at some point or um, something happened. But anyway, um, if you, uh, the reason I'm making this video is it wasn't as straightforward as I was hoping to reinstall it. Um, and so I wanted to just share with you my experience and what worked for me. Um, so if you, the suggested command for installing it is gem space install Cocoa Pods. Um, and I ran that and got an error. Um, it was kind of a long drawn out error, but something about linking and paths. Um, I, I took a look around the web and there were a lot of people running into this error. Um, so uh, again, that's why I'm really making this video. Um, and there, there was a lot of, if you look on Stack Overflow on some other sites, uh, you can see people run into the same issue. Um, at one point I found this command and I did run it. I'll let you know that it ran for a while, like a probably like a solid half hour. Um, uh, I guess uh, getting updated Ruby install. Uh, I'm not sure that's totally necessary because then I found this, which I'll provide the link to this um, in Stack Overflow, and that gave me these commands um, and the brew cleanup dash d dash v. I ran that, and then I ran brew install cocoa pods. Um, there was still an issue with that, but this was actually, it said um, in the Stack Overflow post that you will most likely need to run this as well. And I ran that and that seemed to take care of it. After running this brew link dash dash overwrite Cocoa Pods, um, I was able to uh, check and the version was up to date. If you go to the official site for Cocoa Pods, uh, you'll see this is the current version. If for some reason you don't have Brew, Homebrew, um, here I'll provide the link for installing that, but that's uh, something that most Mac uh, computers have um, have installed. But uh, if you don't, uh, there's a quick, easy guide for doing that. I hope this helps somebody. Um, it would have been nice to have this um, for me as I was going about this. So uh, let me know if you have any questions or if somehow this doesn't work for you. Thanks.